in essence. I feel like Barbara has become an inmate. It's extremely frustrating because I lived in group homes and foster homes. I was homeless. I lived in homeless shelters. I had no place to go. I can relate to a lot of what these people are feeling. <laughs> but there's so many women who love Barbara. I'm so angry over it right now. I know it's, it sounds like a trivial thing, but I have had a really crappy life growing up, a really crappy life. I can relate to so much of what these girls are going through, but they just don't like me. You want my life on your lap? Uh, okay. yeah. No, Barbara, you do you. You be a sheep and do what you need to do. I say sheep because that is a flock in there, and they're all following whatever they need to do. I'm not. I'm not going to be a sheep. I'll be that lone wolf. In about two seconds, I'm going to kick some people out because I need to take a shower, so. You just simply cannot be nice to people. Otherwise, people will walk all over you. The bottom line is, I mean, they're not even going to be right now. I'm not dead. Are you going to be a to me now because you got your girl there? Is that the problem? Why are you starting Problem. Why are you starting because you're being a punk to me because you're not being a punk. Be the wolf or be the sheep. Tammy hates me. I don't know why. <laughs> Tammy is on the verge of falling apart, and it can be very startling and uncomfortable for everybody. If I need to spend my time alone, I'm okay with that. So we're making her a cake before she leaves. Let me give her a cake. I'm not even one of the cake. Clean up as we go. What's going on over here? So we're putting together this cake, and Tammy decides she's going to be a part of it. I'd never had any sense of trust or sense of love growing up, and Sam is working so hard for her family and her little boy, and I appreciate that. And then comes the part where nobody has any money besides me. I'm stuck buying the cookies, the peanut butter, probably like three quarters of the ingredients. Just to let you know, I paid for it. I'm a giver. I give people. There comes a time and a place in here where you have just had enough with people. This is a place where suck people. And you have to say something. So whose cappuccino was that? You always buy cappuccino though. Some of the things that inmates say and do seem to really affect Tammy. What do you get angry for, Amy? I'm not mad at all. It sounds like you are. In jail, you can't let things get personal, and I'm afraid Tammy's doing that. No, oh, it's you today, Tammy. It's nobody else. Seems like you're getting frustrated about this whole cake situation. She's only making her time harder. All right. You know what? Why don't we just scrap the whole thing now, right? Because we can do that. Because I can be a like that. There's something about this place and the people that live here that is very evil. She's mad because she bought all the stuff. Tammy gets really mad, and she's just like fuming mad. She was so angry. You want to do that? Because I'm gonna that way too. Oh my God! What happened? This is for Sam. This is not for you. This is not for me. This is not for Amy. I mean, she leaves for rehab tomorrow. I always buy stuff, and I always buy stuff, and I always buy stuff. Then don't offer to buy it. You was the one that was like, I will buy it. I mean, you know, I'll just blame my bed to all these people. Nobody can get the on. Oh, that cake tastes good. Okay, I'm choking. Really funny Feeling depressed, hopeless in being here, angry, sad. Do you feel like you're losing yourself? Um, yeah. <laughs>